welcome to this channel if it's your first time please consider subscribing by the don't forget to hit the notification bell the uae introduces what we call unemployment insurance scheme to all workers in both the private and the public sector remember when we are talking about the insurance scheme that is being introduced in the uae we are the scheme is mainly the main the main aim of the scheme is mainly to target those people that lose their jobs in the course of losing their jobs they need to have what you call support as they're trying to find a new job as we all know it's quite not very easy losing one job and getting a new one immediately to some people it has been very lucky for them 100 percent before even losing one they already have another one what about to this other individual that do not have that opportunity that they need to, to start afresh to look for that job when you are looking at uae i think a lot of amendments regarding the labor law regarding new many schemes have been introduced starting from what you call the visas that will be introduced in Sunday, september new visa schemes being introduced this is to facilitate the pool of manpower and the new talent on what you call the global market which is quite very true. You know, all this world, all the continents of the world have been affected by what we call the pandemic of the COVID-19. Everything stalled down from unemployment, from, from employment, public sector, healthy sector, which is, has been a very big hurdle. So the UAE introduces what we call an insurance scheme for the unemployed. What does it mean for the private sector and the public sector? This scheme is going to be for all the workers in the Emirates, in all workers living in the UAE, in all the seven Emirates, when we talk about UAE. And how is it going to work? It's going to work in such a way that all people in the UAE will have to insure themselves with the insurance companies that will be decided upon by the government of the UAE or by the Ministry of Emiratization to carry out that process. Meaning that each worker will have to save a given amount of money to that insurance company, depending on how much, depending on the packages that are being given to you on table. Remember, they are going to be packages that will start from 40 dirhams until 100 dirhams. So, you the insured and the insurance company, you can decide on which kind of package you can afford. But remember, something that you need not to forget, when we are talking about that amount of money that will be given in case you get to lose your job, in that two course you are still looking for a new job, you need support. Let's say, for example, you have a family, you need that support. And that is what the government is trying to work on. Right? But as the, the government classified information we have is that the maximum they can give for compensation, the maximum they can give to back you up in that course of looking for a job is going to be dirham 20,000. But remember, before you look at the 20 dirham, the 20,000 dirhams that in compensation that will be paid as you're trying to look for that job. Look at your package that you, you, you applied for in that insurance company. So meaning that it's not, going to be, it's not going to be option. It's going to be for all. And that's what the government is trying to do. By 2023, all people will, be, will have to be insured. However, for the, the, for the information we have right now, we don't know exactly how the government is going to do it. But it's going to be for all workers in the UAE. In case you are working in the UAE, it's going to be mandatory. We don't know yet. It may either be the employer subtracting from your money to keep it with the insurance company, or yourself paying the insurance company, depending on the package you decided with the insurance company, to cater for your situation that you may not anticipate in case you get to lose your job and you're jobless. Because you need to eat, you need to move, you need to look for other job. And yet you're not earning. That is why this scheme is being brought forward. 
such that it can help people in that moment. Remember, it's going to be yearly. The payment is going to be yearly. And it's going to be for all the individuals, for all the individuals in the UAE. Remember? When we are talking about, somebody may ask a question, what is the minimum amount of money to start with? The minimum amount of money to start with is dirham 40, is dirham 40 dirhams. Up to, you can insure yourself from 40 dirhams until 100 dirhams. That is by what the government or by what is the Minister of Emiratization that is saying. Remember? However, still something that we need to note, we need to note in one way or the other, there are different categories of people that will not be under the insurance or the unemployment insurance scheme, especially people who are working temporarily. Uh, people who are not working, people who have what you call temporary contracts. We look at things, we look at people like domestic workers. We look at things, we look at people like the investors. We look at people who are under 18 years of age. We look at people who are in what you call the retirement. Of the, they've got what you call retirement pension. As per the government, those people are not inclusive in the scheme. But the rest of the category of the people that I've not mentioned, you are all mandatory and you all be indulged or you may all be part of the scheme, which is going to be mandatory for all the people in the UAE. And when we are talking about the payment, we talk about the payment. The payment is going to be yearly. When we talk yearly, we say each year. And remember, when we are talking about the compensation, someone would ask me, in case I get to lose the job, how long is the government, how long is that insurance company is going to look after me? Or how long am I going to be receiving the money, that small, that token from that insurance company? It will be for a given period of time that will be agreed upon between you and the insurance company. But remember, something that you did not forget is that you will only receive what you call 60% of what you saved in that insurance company. Or what you saved, at, what you saved as per your package and agreed upon with that insurance company. You will only be receiving what you call 60%. Let me just take you through and just get what, what is up. What you know, the new insurance scheme is made for workers of all nationalities in the UAE. Workers in what you call the public sector and the private sector will enjoy what you call the unemployment insurance starting next year, 2023, according to the Ministry of Human Resources and Humanitization in the UAE. However, something that you, do, you need to know, that the UAE cabinet approved the unemployment insurance scheme to provide what you call the unemployed individual with income support for a limited, given, for a limited period of time. That insurance scheme is going to provide you with a given amount of money or what you call an income support for a given period of time. Between that transition where you are looking for a new job, they will be catering you, but remember giving you 60% of what you saved with that insurance company. And we didn't talk about that saving. Remember, we talked about your different packages, depending on how you agreed or how the government will set it at a given period of time. But again, we still have, we, we, we still are waiting what the government will say because what is going to be the model payment? Look at people working in other depart private departments like securities, security guards, cleaners, technicians, hospitality departments. Then we also have those higher people that are working in what we call the higher professions. What is going to, what's going to be the model payment? Is it going to be on what we call the individual basis or it's going to be on what we call or it's going to be the employer that will be deducting that money automatically and paying it to the insurance company such that you let know and you can access and know how much you have. That is the question that we have. But remember, by the end we get to that, 2023, definitely we shall have a, a right answer for that. 
But just know the scheme is around, the scheme is already gazetted and it's going to be, they are just only waiting for regulations that will be governing the schemes. And it's going to be for all the nationalities or for all the people that are going to be living in the UA, which is quite very good news for people who are going to live in the UA. Because, you know, when you get to lose your job at one way or the other, at least you have something that will take you up as you're trying to look for a new job. Because remember, you'll have to move, you'll have to eat, you'll have to move from one area to another. Probably if you have something that can facilitate you to move from one position to another as you are trying to look for a new job, it's, it's a better deal other than having nothing and yet you have to look for a new job. Or you have to feed in the family. Let's say for example you have a family. Or oh, that family has to go to school or children are to go to school and do not even have a single coin, which is actually very good. You see? So definitely, that one, when definitely what you have to know that this scheme is going to be working correctively with what you call the insurance companies. Those insurance companies will be mentioned by the government and they will be put by, uh, forward by the government that will be in or will be inculcated to deal with those uh, kind of the insurance scheme or the insurance policies. Hope I've tried to share with you. Uh, that is very great news for people in the UAE. Remember UAE is one of the countries also that takes too much consideration uh, that work has also become part of uh, uh, the welfare the welfare of the workers is so much put into consideration thank you so much for coming back to this channel remember it's next by the way if it's your first time please consider subscribing support this channel by subscribing to this channel by the way don't forget to hit that notification bell because it will be the only way that will be updated whenever i upload a new video thank you so much see you again in the next video by the way don't forget to give up the thumbs up don't forget to share this video let us share to a friend let them know and let them also get the same information see you again in